<sighs> What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Steve from SL Effect. I'm feeling some type of way right now because a co worker of mine gave me some disturbing news about a friend of hers um, who's now pregnant. She told me that her friend. She's pregnant and don't know whether she wants to keep the baby or not. And the reason she doesn't know whether she wants to keep the baby or not is because of her boyfriend who got her pregnant. Learning more that her boyfriend told her to get rid of the baby because he does not see himself having a baby with her. Not that he doesn't see himself having a baby with her right now. He said, per her words, he doesn't see himself having a baby with her. Now, these two are supposed to be dating. They're both young. They're in their young, you know, young 20s, play like that. And oddly enough, he lives with her, with her parents. Now, I don't know who her parents are, but they need some help. First of all, you ain't finna make my daughter pregnant and come live at my house. You got life all backwards. Thank God I have no daughters. But that ain't happening if I had a daughter. And he told her, get rid of it. I want you to get rid of it. And she's thinking about getting rid of it because she don't want to lose him. Are you effing stupid? So. You already done made, I ain't going to call it a mistake because y'all knew what y'all was doing. But you're going to get pregnant. And God places a gift inside of your belly. And you want to kill it. Y'all both want it gone. You shouldn't have been laying down doing what grown folks do to have that child. Y'all know what y'all was doing. It's there now. Why don't they just have the baby and put it up for adoption? There are so many people out there right now who can't have children. Would love to have a child. But you want to kill yours. That's sick and sad at the same time. I'm really speechless about this. Her telling me the story just really, really pissed me off. And I, I would really love to know who these two are. I would really love to speak to them. And try to speak some sense into them. But I'm not going to go that far. I'm not going to go that far. Like I said, I don't know them. But I pray that maybe one of them might even see this video and know who I'm talking about. And think about it very, very hard. If if you're pregnant and you thinking about having an abortion just because y'all slipped up and that person, your boyfriend or your friend, whatever, got you pregnant, don't kill that baby. Do not abort that baby. Give it up for adoption. Let somebody else raise the child. It's happened many times in life. 
It'll hurt you later if you do, though. That's, that's a fact. That that is a um, that's a subject that I really hold near and dear to my heart. Abortion. I know a lot of people really don't care about abortion. It's like uh, some people are second nature. Some people don't had three, four, and five abortions. There are people out there that just have abortions for the heck of it. But do they really know the seriousness of killing a baby, aborting a child? If you got raped or a baby passed away in your stomach and you, of course, you got to get rid of it. Of course, you have to get rid of a deceased child. But if you've been raped, that's up to you and God to discuss what you want to do with that child that was placed there. The seeds in a man belong to God. They don't belong to us. Once that baby comes out, we are the ones to raise that child. That's ours now. That's a gift from our Lord and Savior. But to just get rid of it like that, just because you don't want it. Put yourself in that baby's predicament. What if your mama or your daddy wanted you aborted? It's not pretty, is it? Just something I want to speak about today. I hope y'all understand my frustration with abortion. Some of y'all may like this video. Some of y'all may hate this video. And some of y'all, it may make you think. But all I'm asking is if you get pregnant, think long and hard if you're not sure whether you want to keep that baby or not. Because you have a God to face. You have to face your creator on these things. And if you're not a child of God, you don't practice being a child of God, you're going to have literally hell to pay. When that time comes for us to meet our creator, for, for us to meet our God. In the name of Jesus Christ, please. If you're not sure and you're pregnant, you're not sure if you want to have that child. Don't. Don't abort it. That's all I'm pleading. I hope y'all understood this video. I love y'all. And you can't do nothing about it. God bless.